Hey, 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 this is gonna be for the Aquarius. What's up? <laughs> it's your girl Kamani. The one and only. <laughs> Y'all, don't forget to go to exclusive glam goddess.bigfartel.com and shop with your girl, okay? So let's see what's going on with the stars. <laughs> Let's see. What does spirit want my Aquarius to know? What do you want the Aquarius to know, spirit of the highest white divine light? What do you need them to know, spirit? Angels? Holy Spirit? What do you need to know, Holy Spirit? Ooh, I got sunshine on a cloudy day. When it's cold outside, I got the month of May. <laughs> I don't know where that came from, but ooh, that may be a message that um, Spirit wants y'all to know. Initiation. Mm. Warrior woman, have you answered your deepest calling? So some of you guys need to answer yourself. Have you really answered what God has called you to do? Have you really lived the purpose that God has called you to live out? Boundaries. Where do you need to establish better boundaries? A lot of you guys could be letting people walk all over you. Like you some doormat. A lot of you guys need to set heavy boundaries here. And Council of Light, Divine Orchestration, Helpers in the Subtile Realms. A lot of you guys, you have helpers in the spiritual realm. You have people watching over. You have people guiding and watching over. You have a council. You're a council of light. Your spiritual team is with you. You're heavily protected. You're guarded and you're protected. Your ancestors are, are with you. Ain't nobody finna fuck with you. Get grounded. Empaths. Highly sensitive. Connect with nature. A lot of you guys need to get grounded. A lot of you guys need to go outside and connect more with Mother Nature. Connect more with Earth. Going to the beach. Things like that. To help you get grounded. Put your feet in the sand. Connect with earth. You need to get into that, um, get into that towards Virgo Capricorn energy. That earth energy. A lot of you guys are empaths. You're highly sensitive. You guys can pick up on other people's emotions. You need to know how to balance. Balance that. And not allow other people's emotions to take over you. And we have initiation, rite of passage, crossing the th threshold. A lot of you guys are going through an initiation here. Okay, I want to I wanna go in. I want to go in about this initiation, though, because I see this at the bottom of the deck. So I want to go in about this right here. A lot of you guys are... Yeah, a lot of you guys have not answered your calling. You have not answered your calling. You have not answered what it is that you're supposed to be doing. You may think you're doing so, or you have, but you're not. And you're being asked to rise to the occasion. Because your job ain't complete. So, let me see here. So the initiation, this represents a journey that the soul pilgrim is required to take to reach somewhere scarce. But only the initiated can enter. So you're, you, you're being initiated to enter a place that only the initiated can enter. So right now you're being tested. You're being tested, Aquarius. Because you are headed somewhere scarce. So it says here, initiations require that we cross the threshold from world from world from one world or state of being to the next. 
we are being called to face what scares us and have to be willing to lose it all in order to gain a new way of being, of safety, of security, and a depth of meaning here. You guys are being initiated, baby. And you can't be scared. This only this only the better you. You being upgraded. Period. Let's see what else. Oh my bad. I forgot these out here. Let's see what else spirit wants y'all to know. Uh. <laughs> Yo. I like my nails. Mm. What else you want? Um, what else you want Aquarius to know? Also, you guys need to check your North Node. Some of you guys may have a North Node in Aquarius. Check your birth chart. Even also, so this you know, what I'm saying you don't have to be a, a, a just just a, just a Sun. Your Sun don't have to just be in Aquarius. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in North Node. You know, if you have placements or any placements. Um, in your chart regarding the Aquarius, this could apply to you. Your North Node is what you're destined, your destiny. It is what you're called to do. So we have moving forward. Get ready for positive change. Once again, that confirm the initiated Council of Light, Warrior, Woman. Have you answered your deepest calling? A lot of you guys, things are getting, you guys are, you guys are being upgraded. You guys are being initiated and you're getting ready to move forward. And as you move forward, you need to know, you need to know how to set healthy boundaries with people. Get ready to get grounded because you're getting ready to go towards positive change. There's going to be choices and you better make the best choices. Make the best choices because spirit is testing you. Spirit is testing you. Spirit want to see if you ready for this. Do you deserve this right now at this time? So you're being tested. So you need to make the right choices. Self-reliance. Don't be afraid to fight solo either, baby. Don't be afraid to fight solo. Don't let nobody try to knock you off your motherfucking horse. You know what I'm saying? Don't let nobody try to get you out of character. Don't let nobody try to tempt you. You got to stay grounded. Your ancestors, your angels, your spirit guides. The Holy Spirit, they behind you. You are heavily protected. And nobody ain't going to get in the way of what you meant to do. Because anybody get in the way of what you're meant to do, that's your calling, they're going to be dealt with. They're going to be dealt with. And that's on period. You see how... Look at you, you. You see that? You got a team, baby. You got a team. You got a team. Because you're a council of light. You got a team behind you. The spiritual realm, work, they rocking with you heavy. They rocking with you. Because you're here to complete a mission. You're here to, you're, you're here to complete a mission. Ain't nobody finna play with you. And look, and at the bottom of the initiated, you got, you're already doing it. Stop overthinking. Keep facing your true north. Once again, I just said North Node. You guys are you guys you guys are are being initiated. You guys are, are, are going to have many choices. You have to make the right choices. You guys need to set healthy boundaries because a lot of you guys are stepping into your North Node. Period. What else? What else do my, does my Aquarius need to know here? Courage. Look it up. You can't make this up, baby. Look how look how spirits talk to you. Discipline. I can accomplish what I set my mind to. A lot of you guys need to be disciplined. Stay grounded. Be disciplined. Don't let nobody knock you off your motherfucking shit. Period. And have courage. I have the inner strength to face fear with confidence. Be like the motherfucking lion. You have the willpower. You have the strength to move forward through anything. You got this. Stand strong. Stand confident. Know who you are. Don't let nobody tell you who the fuck you is. You know who the fuck you is. Change. I understand that nothing can grow on or involve without movement. Don't just stand still. Move forward. Know that change is coming. Change is here. Period. You being upgraded. 
Let me get some messages here from you guys. A lot of you guys could have been feeling alone, feeling orphan, like an orphan, like an orphan or some shit. But you guys are building. Building blocks. You guys are building something great. Y'all don't need to lose hope. Don't lose hope. Don't lose sight of the bigger picture here. Because a new life is on its way, baby. You blessed. Blessed is finna pour down on you. And that's on period. It ain't shit nobody can do about it. Because you the motherfucking star. That's who you are. Period. Yeah, change. You can't make. Change right here. Change. I can't make this shit up. Change right here. Change in the wind. Thank you, angels. Thank y'all. Thank you, angels. Thank you. Your whole life finna get ready to change. A lot of you guys may, a lot of you guys, a lot of you guys finna, finna get ready to be moving from, 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 to another state or to a different city. A lot of you guys finna literally, your home finna fucking change. Your location, your address, you finna be upgraded. A lot of you guys are finna enter some new shit. Period. A lot of you guys finna be in milk and honey. A lot of you guys finna be spoiled as fuck. Spoiled as fuck. Rich as fuck. You guys finna be motherfucking grounded in your earth energy. Period. Stable. Solid. A lot of you guys about to go from rats to motherfucking riches. Rats to riches. Rats to riches. Rats to riches. What? Okay. Period. Milk and honey. Fuck they talking about. <laughs> well, I thought I hate to say it something. I thought I had to say something. Because who you is, you a council of light. Okay? Period. Period. As a matter of fact, let, let's let's let, let's go let's go more deeper into account. Look, 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 I God put it right on right on right in my face. Let's go to a council of light. Council of light is a team of bilivant beings who are here to assist the raising of consciousness of the planet. They are here to help you achieve your soul mission. And are guiding you every step of the way. However, because we live in a world where free, where free will reigns, they cannot help you without your permission. So what spirit is saying is, you have the spiritual realm. They're rocking with you, baby. They're rocking with you. But you have free will. The help is there. But you have to let your Spirit guides, you have to let your angels, you have to let the spiritual realm help you. They're guiding you. You have to follow and let them assist. So if you would like their assistance, all you got to do is ask. So they can help you with all kinds of requests. There's nothing too small or nothing too big. Think of them as your personal team of helper, helpers. So the so your um the Council of Light is your ascended masters, light beings, angels. <laughs> Sorry about that, you guys. So anyway, like I was saying, um, you know, your um, Council of Light, those are your, ascend your ascended ma masters, your angels, your spirit guides. To here help you with your soul mission. All you have to do is pray, ask them for assistance, ask them for anything you need. Anything you need, they're here. They're here to guide you. Okay, y'all. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. What's up for the Aquarius here? A lot of you guys are intelligent. A lot of you guys are intelligent here. A lot of you guys are very smart. You are very clear. You have clarity. You know the answers. You know how to go within. Can't shit get over you. Some of you guys may be meant to be attorneys as well. Boundaries here. Boundaries. Some of you guys may, you guys need to establish and know how to set healthy, healthy boundaries with people, places, or things. A lot of you guys may pour and give too much in a situation, and then you end up feeling like you alone and abandoned, like you left out in the cold, like you don't, like you don't gave everything you got, and now you feeling like you, you know what I'm saying? Cause you guys need to learn how to set boundaries with people. Sometimes you gotta learn to leave some leave some things out in the cold and not bother. Sometimes you need to know how to just pray for people. Sorry to hear that. I pray for you. Sometimes you gotta know how to just you know 
pray for people. Yeah, Council of Light here. A lot of you guys could have been indecisive, not know what to do, not seeing something clearly here. But you guys need to go within and search for the for the inner guidance, inner guidance and wisdom here. You guys have divine wisdom and knowledge. You 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 know. A lot of you guys could be. A lot of you guys could have been blocking your intuition here. Really holding back. Really holding back. Really keeping something within. And pretty much hurting yourself. Hurting yourself. But success and recognition is here. Victory is here. But you need to walk out. You need to walk away from, from some things. So you need to walk away from some things that may be hurting you. That's not serving you. That you know deep down you need to let go. And you need to move forward. Into victory and success. Walk with confidence. Walk with courage and strength. And boss the fuck up. Because you're going to be stable. 444. 444. Look that up. If you don't know, look it up. 444. You're going to be stable as fuck. Period. Okay, y'all. Did I get some of these? Oh, yeah. I got some of this. Change in the wind. So, that's it for you all, um, Aquarius. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Okay.